it so quick, quick. It's finished. Oh, oh, welcome to the first video of 2021, which, fingers crossed, should be better. So what are we doing today? The first video of 2021 and the first one of, I think, three today. I think, yeah, should be three. I think it's three. So dear, dear, you're welcome. So before we get into the meat and bones of today's video, I wanted to check out the channel in 2020, what happened? Because to me, it's a complete blur. I would have been stuck in this room for a whole year and it would just be making videos and nothing much has changed. So there is this little uh, app that allows uh, to condense your channel into bite-sized chunks, like what was your most popular videos, uh, engagement, all that jazz. So this is the first time that I'm going to see it and uh, I'm looking forward to it. Here we go, the gaming beaver, that's me, that's me, sound is on. Should sound be on? All right, let's, let's click start. 2020, I don't even know how the year was for the channel. It was good, right? <laughs> First, let's go back to January 1st. I had 2.5, oh, we got half a million subscribers. Hey, not bad. My top three, oh, Jurassic World Evolution, but no surprise there. Oh, the Minecraft, the Minecraft, and what was my number one video of this year? It was an Isle video, no way. Oh, that's crazy. Part three as well. Okay. Uh, subscribers get, we get, whoa. Okay, this I didn't know. We gain more views and our uploads were down. Oh my God. Oh, I need to break this down. So we got 440,000 subs, 2 billion. And what a year. Th there you go. Beautiful, how was that? Okay, let's let's turn this down music off, it's awful. Let's look at these top three videos. So Jurassic World Evolution modded now. I think a lot of people, I mean, it's the only thing I can kind of really do in Jurassic World Evolution is mods because they're cool. They add something different to the game. And apart from that, just, I've pretty much done everything. Um, so actually that number three spot should go to the community of Jurassic World Evolution for making amazing models and coding it and adding new things in. So that's, and I guess we do Jurassic World Evolution, the base. Uh, and the second spot, uh, Minecraft. When, when I started 2020, uh, I was like, I mean, the COVID happened. I was like, oh no, this is, this is gonna be bad, man. This is, this is gonna be really bad. But we had so many things sort of like come out of nowhere. Um, the, the Minecraft, Jurassic World Minecraft was one of them. This is episode five. I love it. I love it. You used to see like part ones do really well uh, on YouTube channels, but that, that's a part five. I am only gonna say that's probably done really well Probably because of the thumbnail. I mean, it's got Indominus Rex in there, Indoraptor, the Jurassic World. It's got everything you want. Doesn't matter how it's got me in it. <laughs> and number one, uh, that that kind of amazes me. The Isle, two million views. If you'd asked me what was my most popular video in 2020, I definitely wouldn't have said an Isle. Because they, they do well, but they don't like perform the most amazing, but maybe they do. Maybe maybe I should be making morale videos, but that is exactly what today's video is about because we're gonna jump in to uh, something quite special when it comes to the aisle. Uh, I came across it a while ago and I saved it just for like a video like this. Before we do that, let's have a look at this. So we gained from 2019, we gained 70% extra subscribers, 38% more views, 352 million Oh. But we uploaded 30% less. How, cr that is crazy. You think, you know, we, we upload 30% less, we'd see 30% less views, but we see even more. And I can only think that that's to do with the quarantine. You know, more people are watching uh, videos and maybe just discovering my old, you know, catalog that I've got. So I only made 228 videos. Look at that. Last year was 325 yeah! out of a 360 day year. It's almost a video every day. Whereas I'm, I'm actually really happy that that 2020 shit looks like that, that it's a lot less because I wanted to take more of a, a step back, enjoy life a little bit, have some free time. Cause God, as a YouTuber, you don't have free time. Whereas, you know, it's, it's your own business. You have to do it all yourself, especially I'm, you know, I'm my own ed editor and everything like that. So everything I do is, is me and it takes such a long time. And I, I wanted more time for other things in my life. Uh, so I'm sorry, no offense. <laughs> How was your ending the year? So we got three million. Did it. Can we get confetti and cheers? Yeah, there we go. But this only shows so much. What I want to do is have a quick rundown of the entire channel. So the first video of 2020 was uh, a Jurassic World Evolution video. Uh, it was the last DLC I think we ever got. 
um, which was the Jurassic Park DLC, and that was episode three. I That feels like so long ago. And I was like still playing the out. And then mods happened in January. January 17, mods happened. And that's when we got the Allosaurus and stuff. Hungry Shark released a new shark. Primal Carnage like started coming back as well. And there it is, the mystery of the Japanese Sonic statue. That was uploaded in February. I, I'm so glad that I did that final trip to Japan. I was like, I'd already been that year in the summer and I was like, oh, I wanna go back so badly. And then when I, I found out about this Sonic statue in the, in, you know, the mountains in Japan, I was like, I have to, that's, a, that's more than an excuse, I gotta go. Uh, and I'm so glad I did because we were there December to January uh, and we filmed this. And then, you know, two months later, or three months later, quarantine, like all around the world. So I'm so glad that in 2020, I got something different apart from video games because that was, little to my knowledge, gonna be the rest of the year. Oh, oh, we got the Jurassic Park pinball machine. Yes, I got that. That was a good purchase before the quarantine. <laughs> Catching up on funny montages because finally I, I managed to do it. Oh yeah, we got a shield wall. That was a fun one to do. Attack the doors. Yeah. <laughs> and this, this right here, man eater. Like, it was at this point when I was, I was, you know, quarantine had, had proper started kicking in at this point. And I was like, oh, oh, okay, what, what can I do? What, like, what, what is there? What is there to come out? And then Manita came out of nowhere and I was like, yes, finally, something new. So I'm so happy that I managed to, like, Manita was released then. It really filled in my time. <laughs> Reacting to my Deadland series. Best series on YouTube. Oh look, Warhammer, there it is. This was on July, when I thought my addiction was getting bad. Ha, <laughs> little did I know it was about to get so much worse. More mods. Oh, and I started getting back into, um, into depth. I really started loving it. And then I was distracted because in August, which feels like ages ago, but it really wasn't, Minecraft dinosaurs, or sort of Minecraft Jurassic World came out. Another one, it felt like, I, I was like, I don't know, I needed something, like a game or something, and we had Man Eater, and that quickly dropped, because like, we completed it so quickly. I was like, oh, what's what's next? And then, out of nowhere, as if descended by the, given to the, from me by the gods, we have Jurassic World Minecraft. Came, like, and I was like, oh, okay, I'll do this then. <laughs> that really helped, my god. And then, of course, we had Little Nightmares to react to that trailer. Camp Cretaceous. I think 2020 um, could have been a lot worse it, for me because of all of these like random gems that just, for me, appeared out of nowhere. Like, Man Eater was like floated about, but the Jurassic World Minecraft came out of nowhere. And then Camp Cretaceous was like, oh yeah, we're, we're this year now. They, there you go, Camp Cretaceous now. Wow, and then we're up to current day. Oh, of course, Among Us. I played that a little bit. That was loads of fun. I wish I'd made more on it, but uh, everyone was like, oh, we've already played. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I guess I don't play it anymore. Second Extinction as well. That was another one. That feels like so long ago. It was only October. That's crazy. Oh, and then I finally caught up with the funny montages. At this point, everybody had been, you know, sort of isolating for so long that they just wanted these party games. Among Us, Phasmophobia, and let's not forget, Fall Guys, which actually 2020 was the first year that I started kind of regularly uh, doing live streams and Fall Guys was one of, like, was the main thing, the main reason why I did that. We did a lot. We, we really did a lot, more than I thought. More, because I couldn't go out and do other content. Um, I'm just so glad that I got that Sonic statue done and it was something different. Because I noticed when this quarantine happened that my videos that I'd done, you know, uh, a soccer aquarium or anything that was, you know, swimming with basking sharks, anything that was outside, everybody was like, oh, I want to watch this. And their views just went up. And I was, I'm glad that, you know, I'm not just a, a Let's Play channel. I'm more like anything I want to do whether it gets views or not. At some point in my life, I'm gonna look back, I'm gonna look back at this channel and I'm gonna think, yeah, yeah, I did all those things. And you know, it's all documented. It, it's like it's like a photo album, except for a channel. And I can just go back and see uh, all the things that I did. And I feel like I've only done this channel for what? Four years, six years now? For six years. And I feel like we've come so far, we've done so many things. And you know, without the support, 
of you guys watching and enjoying and sharing in our dinosaur nerdy hobby together. Uh, <laughs> we wouldn't have been able to do all these crazy things. <laughs> How about now we do some of this, like, I, I watched like two seconds of this. I was like, nah, this has to be a video. This has to be a video, it has to. So this is from a Swiss Hasaurus. Um, and I clicked on it and I just love the like to dislike ratio. <laughs> <laughs> so first off, I just want to say don't go and give this guy hate. It was obviously a joke. Um, the more malicious people that do this kind of thing, don't upload videos about it. And he even says like, oh, who should I impersonate next? What I'm curious about, this guy went on a server uh, and tried to convince, convince sorry, another streamer uh, who goes by Simo that he was me. Every now and again, I get comments on Discord of people uh, messaging me saying, oh, there's a, there's a, uh, an imposter in the aisle. Are you, are you oh, there's somebody pretending to be you. Are you playing? And I go, no. And if you join our Discord, you can see what, I, what I'm doing if I'm playing a game or anything as it shows on there. So if you see someone who's pretending to be me and it doesn't show me on the Discord, it's not me. For a start, anyway. Like, is there any mannerisms that he does? Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, let's watch. Yo, what is going on guys? In today's video, we are going to be doing something I haven't really done yet. I, I've never really done a, a prank like this. Tyrannical Simo. We are going to be pranking him that we are the YouTuber, the famous, the popular, the gaming beaver. I'm going to be doing this in a very strategic way and uh, try to trick him the best I can in the rest of the server. And it, let me tell you, it works out pretty That's good. the main reason. I want to know what he does. Like, th I, I've, even in the last Isle video, it's someone who was just so sure that I was an imposter to the point where he's hurling abuse at me. Like it's, like, it's got to this stage where some people are like, nah, it's never the real people. So what, what did he do? Just want to give a huge thanks real quick to all the admins over on the bio aisle for helping me and playing along with this, especially Ant-Man. You're welcome. The owner of the bio aisle. Link in the description for their discord and link in the description for Beaver's YouTube channel. Of course, you probably already know it, but. Wait, did he, did he actually credit? Did he, did he link my YouTube channel? He did as well, it's above, it's above the fold. <laughs> nice, I, I see you. So first thing I gotta do is I gotta change my name to the Gaming Beaver, of course, and then I have to completely replicate his profile. Oh, uh, okay, how'd you do this? That's the best way to do it. So let's change my name and let's find an accurate profile picture for Beaver. Okay, for a start, for a start, when you change your username, it like Steam does tell you what they've also went by, so what they've changed it to. And I think mine's only ever been like two. It's like a game and people, the game and people. So that's that's another way to tell if you can even like view profiles on that uh, on. Nile. I scoured the internet for his uh, correct profile picture that matches his Steam, and um, I'm kind of stupid because it was right in front of me the whole time. I clicked. I was gonna on say, you just go on, just go on the profile. profile picture. Now oh, it is time to. I had no idea my profile was so private. Just outline the screenshot, <laughs> and boom, save it. <laughs> and now we're gonna put it as my Steam profile picture. All right, so we got the <laughs> picture uploaded, and yeah, cheeky buggy. <laughs> okay, this looks so. Can you not find legit. that picture anywhere else? So let's save the changes, and let's uh, let's boot up the game. When I start my YouTube channel. Six years ago, I had no idea that this was gonna be a thing. This is so cool. Beaver, he's cool. In I've a way. I've been watching him for six years now. Very long time. I'm a, a veteran of his channel, I guess you can say, but it's so. Uh, can't wait to see people's reaction um, to him being on the game. James, or the gaming beaver, he's never really like grown. <laughs> he doesn't really understand how to play the game. He doesn't have a lot of time. <laughs> It doesn't know how to play the game. <laughs> so basically, we're gonna impersonate him. We're gonna be an idiot. We're gonna have something like a Dillo or so, like something easy to grow. Like let's do a, <laughs> a Serato because he's never really done a Serato video, so it's gonna be something new. So Interesting. Yeah, let's do a Interesting. I wonder if yeah, I was being a Serato really at this point. Okay. If I never made a video on it, make it seem like I am Beaver. So this already, come on, this already, like other than my Steam ID, I doubt they're gonna go looking for a Steam ID because that's very difficult to go through all of his videos looking for a Steam ID, but come on. That's what I should do. I should start every owl video like, this is my Steam ID, there you go, done. <laughs> Look how legit that looks, like seriously. I've noticed that Beaver doesn't really talk in global at all. Like he doesn't really talk in global that much. Unless I need nests. My goal. <laughs> 
is to find more Serratos or something near me that I can talk to to sort of nudge people and like, oh wait, is that Beaver? Is it, I just, I, I hope there's more Serratos. That way I can talk in local and then be, because that's usually how Beaver like talks to people. He'll find them, he'll find other species, he doesn't really care about global, he'll find other species, he'll talk to them in uh, local. Beaver, Beaver doesn't have a lot of time to play this game, so he doesn't really know like what he can actually match up against. He kind of likes to run from things. <laughs> I'm trying to shame them or anything. I'm just pointing out their play behaviors. <laughs> He's, not He's not wrong. He's not wrong. He's gonna go in the. Oh shoot. <laughs> Hello. Already. Already. Uh, the typing with the Elo. Didn't even. Didn't even hesitate. He was, he was gonna die, and he's like, hello, <laughs> in global, to try not to die. You jammy git. <laughs> oh. It never helps me, I always end up dying anyway. Oh my god, it's the <laughs> Um. <laughs> if I said yes, you wouldn't believe me. And not worded correctly, but I would, with the same kind of example, I would be like, if I was, would you believe me? Not like, you wouldn't believe me, like, it's That's pretty what much the says. He says, if I said yes, you wouldn't believe me. <laughs> oh my gosh, again, we're getting people, we're getting people. Oh my god, this is brilliant. Okay, okay, they believe us, they believe us, oh my gosh. Because I'm usually concentrating, I don't get to spend this much time looking at chat. Oh god. Oh, oh. Oh, and yeah, they probably did think it was you. That's why you died instantly. Okay, but someone's now. reaction is priceless. Watch. Come find Beaver, guys. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty. His reaction. Whoa. <laughs> oh, I need to oh, this is great. So I've never actually played with Simo. Uh, I think we both played. I was watching him stream once. Uh, when Overmer first came out, but apart from that, I, I've never, I never uh, came across the guy. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, even he thinks he's skeptical. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. So no suspicions yet. This is this video is. Wait, did he out leave very his well. family? Oh my God, he did. <laughs> Sounds everywhere. <laughs> he's really playing stupid. <laughs> he's still skeptical. I would be too. So he's still skeptical. Now, how does he convince him though? This is the interesting thing. I think he, I think I'm fooling him. I wouldn't even need- I would be like- I wouldn't even care. I would be like, well, it'll be in the video, right? So, whether he believes me or not, I wouldn't want- I wouldn't even want to convince him. I'd just be like, let's- let's play and have some fun. But if he does, I want to see how he does it. <laughs> it's just like a normal aisle video when they think it's me, I get eaten. <laughs> Wait, you're the real? Cool! I- Guys, we have them fooled. I- I don't know- I don't know how much more confirmation we can get. We literally have them fooled. Well, I guess. Okay, let's do this. Wait a minute! He became a friggin' adult? <laughs> well, we just fast forward like five hours or something. What the hell? <laughs> the imposter has done what I bloody can't. <laughs> I mean, I like the I like the the music choice there as well. It's Zelda. So e Eve's even trying to emulate my editing a little bit. <laughs> oh my god! Is the imposter gonna kill him? Oh my god! <laughs> now you know it's not me. Now you know it's not me because I'm winning. <laughs> there you go. Did I win? <laughs> oh, come on. I'm not that stupid. <laughs> what? <laughs> Beaver's just killing everything, dude. <laughs> I know Beaver ain't a fan of rules, so that seems like him. <laughs> <laughs> When the rules favor me, then yes. <laughs> We're just killing everybody. <laughs> okay, ways to impersonate Beaver. Look like an idiot. I break the rules. <laughs> Pretty much. Oops, sorry, lol. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I just, my, my, my hand just slipped and I kept on killing over and over and over again. So basically next all we did is walked around for a little bit. We were, um, our goal was to go to twins. So I was like, you know what? I don't really want to walk all the way to twins. So I DM'd Amp and I'm like, yo, can you spawn as like a Giga or something and murder me on the beach? And so he did just that. <laughs> uh, so it was disappointing. I thought we would do copyright music. Ah, uh, here comes the Giga. You son of a 
and that'll be for today's video. <laughs> there is so much! Awesome! Oh, I'm so sorry! You, you son of a- I'm assuming he just charged over there and killed the Giga that killed fake me. Oh, bless him! You throw people try so hard to become a T-Rex and you just kill him! <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Okay, what's the what's the wrap-up of this? Go on, tell me. Yo, if, if you guys did enjoy this video, uh, then... Oh, okay, it's just a, it's a, it's a enjoy the video, okay. A like button, that'd be awesome. I worked really hard to get this video out and edited this and all that fun stuff, so I would really like it if it could semi-blow up and kind of just get big in the community, so you can help me... <laughs> Humble, I see. Uh, yeah, I spent ages on this video. It would be it would mean a lot to me if you could just like it and share it so it could blow up. That'd be great. Help by liking the video. That'd be awesome. Also, if you made it this far, uh, comment down below which content creator I should do next. You can do any, like, big content. Impersonate yourself! That has over, like, a thousand subs. Except wait, wait, can... do you have a thousand subs? That man, he doesn't have a thousand subs. Bollocks! Can we get him over a thousand subs, guys? Get, give him a thousand subs. I don't want him to impersonate himself. Did he ever impersonate anybody else? Oh. No. Oh, well, there you have it. That was, that was it. I'm so sorry, Simo. You seem genuinely upset when fake me got killed by a Giga, so... I apologize for for that. Uh, <laughs> not the really much I could do though, really. Oh look, he's even got like the same thumbnail. Like, sorry, title, life of a sub adult Rex. There we go. To end it, don't send hate to this guy. He seems to have stopped it. And anyway, it was all for a joke. But that was just a harmless little joke. And I, <laughs> and it was good. It was good. And I got a video out of it. Yes. <laughs> but anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, hopefully 2021 is much better to you and me than 2020 was and we can restore some sort of normality and I will of course get back to doing what I do. I'm gonna keep on beavering away making my content a like the joke. <laughs> but anyway guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and until next time, I'll see you later as an imposter. Bye!